Hello students, welcome to your class. This is your GK class. Today we are going to learn about three chapters that is about our friends at home, high in the sky and computer knowledge. These three chapters. We have already completed these three chapters in our live classes but I have not sent any video today. This video is for that. So first we will learn page number 36 our friends at home these friends are not like human beings they are the electric appliances which we use in our day-to-day -day life and that makes our life more comfortable and we can save our time that makes our work easy so let's see what are these appliances first one number one you can see this is the picture of a fridge right or refrigerator what does a freeze do? This appliances keeps our food safe and fresh for some time. So the main function of this fridge or refrigerator is to preserve our food for some days. This is number one. Number two, you have to write its name here. Okay, you have to write the name here. Number two is the picture of a vacuum cleaner. So what does a vacuum cleaner do? It used to keep the room dust free. We use the vacuum cleaner to keep our room dust free. Number three, this is the picture of an AC. You all know that. But what does an AC do? We get cool air during the summer season or during the hot weather from AC. So the full form of AC is air conditioner. Number four is washing machine. What does a washing machine do? It helps us to wash our clothes. It cleans our clothes and saves our time. So you will write here washing machine. Number five is the picture of a microwave oven. So we use the microwave oven to heat our food or to cook food so you will write here microwave oven you can see here an IQ test is here what is a water heater in a bathroom called that is geyser so these are the electric appliances which helps us as a friend like a friend help us in our real life they are all they also help us in our day-to-day -day life they makes our work more easy and we become more comfortable. They saves our lots of time also. Next we will learn about page number 37 that is computer knowledge. This page we have completed today in our live class. So you have your computer book. You all know what does a computer do? What are the names of the parts? What does the function for what are the functions of these body parts? Now here we will learn about few definitions and few function of these parts. You have to write the names same as before. Here you have to write the names. So number one it is also known as the brain of a computer. So you know that this is the CPU. So this is the CPU and you have to write here CPU or central processing unit. But what is the function of the CPU? The function of the CPU is to process the data or process the data we gave to the computer. So what are the functions the computer do that all are done by the CPU? Number two, it is a screen. It looks like a TV. So you can see here this looks like a TV screen, LED screen this is a monitor it is an output device it displays the functions we do on the computer the things we do on the computer displays so it is an output device monitor number three it helps to move the pointer to different places on the screen you know that this one the small one this is the thing that is a mouse so mouse helps the mouse pointer to move to the different places on the screen this is also an input device 
Number four, it has many keys. We type letters by this. So you can see here, this has many keys. These are keys. First of all, keys that doesn't mean lock and key. These are all the switches or buttons we can see on a keyboard. So these are known as keys. Number five, it is a USB flash drive for data storage. This one, the small one, written Sony here, it is the pen drive and pen drive is also known as flash drive. So what is the function of a pen drive? It can store huge amount of data in it, inside it and this is a temporary storage device. We can remove or we can erase the data we have stored whenever we want and it is very easy to carry. So nowadays pen drive is used so nowadays pen drive is used very commonly or very popular pen drive is very popular in use number six prints on paper the pictures or text that we have typed so what does a printer do printer prints on paper you can see the picture of a printer here so you have to write here printer printer prints the pictures or text we have seen in on the monitor screen now do you know that the first computer was as huge as a room so we were unable to carry those computers anywhere here and there we cannot we were unable we cannot carry those computers but who has invented that computer that computer was invented by Charles Babbage that's why he is known as the father of computer so what is a computer that is suitable for use while traveling we call it laptop the pump top computer or the tablet you also can carry but laptop is more in use because it has more functions and we can do more things on laptop next we will learn this page high in the sky what you have to do you have to write the names like I have written here you have to write the names of these heavenly bodies what is heavenly bodies in the sky you have seen that at daytime you have seen the Sun at night time you have seen the moon and stars clouds you have seen so these are all known as heavenly bodies now here some information is given and you have to write the name so number one is i shine in the sky during the day i am here i am very hot and bright i give you heat and light my name rhymes with bun i am the sun so sun is rhymes with bun and it gives us heat and light sun is the main source of energy of the earth's energy if there is no sun there will be no life do you know that sun is also a star then why it looks so big sun is also a star but sun is near to us than the other stars we see at night so that's why sun looks bigger and other stars look smaller because they are very far away from us sun has its own light and it gives light and heat to the world next i shine in the sky at night i am milky white my light is cool my name rhymes with the spoon i am the moon i have already written so you know that moon uh, appears at night but do you know that moon and stars always stays in the sky we cannot see the moon and stars at daytime because of the sun rays because sun rays is so bright that we cannot see the other heavenly bodies but at night time when we cannot see the sun that time we can see moon and stars number three is i twinkle in the sky at night no one can count my numbers we cannot count the stars it looks very small because of which is very far away so i have written the answer number four sometimes i am white and cottony sometimes i am dark i keep on moving in the sky when i am dark I bright I bring rain so that is clouds you know that rhymes with crowd it is clouds clouds can be black or white or gray 
द ग्रे और ब्लैक क्लाउड्स और द डार्क क्लाउड्स ब्रिंग्स रेन यू नो दैट नाउ हेयर इन आई क्यू टेस्ट देर इज अ क्वेश्चन द मून इज नॉट विजिबल फॉर वन डे इन अ मंथ दैट इज ट्रू वी कैन नॉट सी द मून वन डे इन अ मंथ दैट डे द मून डजेंट अपेयर होप यू हैव अंडरस्टूड you have you have learned these three chapters in your live classes here i just revised all the chapters if you face any problem you can ask me in the live class